Hey Eduardo, this is Mark. Hey, I'm going to go over three different uh, three tips you can do today to help you bring more customers in. Man, I know times are tough, so we really just want to help businesses grow. Uh, so, by the end of the video, you you uh, you think we can really help you out, man? Uh, reach out. We'd love to chat. Uh, otherwise, you can take these tips and and do them yourself. Uh, so let's just jump right into it. Uh, so the first thing we want to go over today is your content. Uh, you want to have at least 1,500 words of content on your home page. Google really loves content, so I mean, you really want to have these buyer intent keywords throughout your your fifteen hundred words, and which we'll go over the the keywords in just a sec. Another thing you want to do is you want to name these pictures that you have. Uh, you want to save them under underneath one of those keywords as well. So if we go try to save one of these, you've got this one saved. You just you know a resized picture. It's not it's not really saved as a keyword or anything. So. Uh, you, want, you really want to have these these pictures saved as as uh, something that will link back to your site. So, um, going over this, this is your next thing we want to go over are your citations. As you can see here, this is what we call a map pack, and typically this is this is your goal to be on page one, right, as a business. So, because you know consumers are are typically going to choose uh, one of the first ones on this up up here, or if not one of these businesses down here at the bottom. Um, so how do you get here? Well, really your your citations are your business name, address, and phone number uh, when registered through directories such as Yelp.com, Yellowpages.com, or or even a Better Business Bureau. Um, you want to have uh, you know Yelp. Yelp is one of the big ones, and when it's created in Yelp, it creates a backlink to your page. Which you know going over the the backlinks are next. Um, as you can see down here underneath the, the map pack is your organic section. And um, really, you know, that your keywords and backlinks play a big part in how you're ranked down here. So going over to your to this is another system that we call that we use as Eris, and it gives you a um, a basic idea of how your website's performing. And uh, with this it shows how many keywords you guys have and uh, your referring domains and uh, which which in turn shows you exactly how many people are coming to your to your page uh on for, through your online traffic so you guys have one organic keyword and uh gomez tree service so you guys are getting about 80 80 people a month that are searching for this and um it's not showing a whole lot of activity coming off your off your web page so you know going over to your your competition here these guys have 83 organic keywords and uh, they're getting about 76 people a month off of these uh, these keywords. So you know, if we did a little bit of work, you know, you put you some some good content and some great keywords, um, man. So what would you know by just by doing that? You know, we're not too far off. So what would about 70, 80 people a month do for your business, right? So again, you know, with these buyer intent keywords, you know, you want to have. The, the right ones which in turn will, will bring more traffic to your site so you know as far as the backlinks you know not all backlinks are created equal so you may want to you know these these have the rule of not following them which won't will um, give you a, your site power and at times it may take away from it you know so you know these uh with you know it's very time consuming and really which is why most businesses hire somebody else to do this for them so uh, also, man, when you when you create a backlink, it also gives your your site search engine power. So, it's almost like a popularity contest in in Google's eyes, and um, in turn will give you the authority to to be on back up here on on page one, really. So, um, again, man, if you if you guys like what you've heard and um, you want us to take away, you know, do it for you and and save you the time from it, uh, reach out, man. We'd love to chat with you guys. Uh, simply reply back to the email. Uh, my name and phone number, email address is, is inside the email. Uh, we look forward to hearing from you guys, and we hope you found it informational. Again, my name is Mark, and we look forward to hearing from you. Talk to you soon.